UK Tourism Minister highlights the importance of public-private partnership to deal the crises. But I think that transparency is key. I say that public-private partnership is really important. Speed of decision-making is really important as well, in recognising that we're doing so with imperfect information um, and communicating as clearly as possible. And I think governments around the world have shown that if there's a need for an intervention, there's a willingness for government to intervene in a way that we haven't seen for a long period of time. Um, and so I think that ongoing partnership is key. I am very, very optimistic about the long-term future for the global travel and tourism sector because the demographics and everything and the economic trends are absolutely in our favour. Uh, the sector is always, uh, you know, getting hit, but then recovers with incredible speed. Newly appointed Honorary Secretary General of Faith shares his vision forward. Being in ITO, I was looking after the affairs of the Indian Association of Tour Operators, that is, inbound tour operators, but now I have a bigger role. Uh, uh, the interest of other associations have also to be, have also to be looked into. And uh, especially what we are trying in ITO also to get some relief from the government on various issues, whether it is SEIS or EGLC. Whatever, whatever those things are, we are, we are trying a level best. And I think on being on the uh, faith platform, uh, there are chances that we might be able to get those, those benefits in the near future. Finland Tourism discusses its unique offering for MICE travellers. We have a lot of these smaller luxury hotels or smaller even basic hotels which can be uh, taken privately. If there can be a proper buyout of the entire property you know, or even like an igloo accommodation. Entire accommodation can be uh, you know, privately booked for a corporate wherein they are sure that you know, it's only them, uh, all the people are tested and that's, it, it's the only access is with them. So, uh, and even islands, you know, can be uh, booked privately. Finland will be uh, like opening borders starting May and they're looking at uh, accepting vaccination certificates or negative, uh, you know, uh, COVID reports to start. UAE extends the ban on passengers from India till May 14th. ADTOI forms COVID assistance task force for members. Justa Hotels and Resorts announces new opening in Dharmshala, Justa Birding Dharmshala.